To trace the origins. Who asked me to trace the origins? It was a concept, a collage, to make new connections, create new meanings. You must understand, environments are being forgotten, unseen and modified. It was a response to what is happening. Rivers and underwater environments changing. Poetry, painting, figural representation. Crossing boundaries, looking for new techniques to complement each other. To stimulate thinking. To, to stimulate, stimulate thinking. thinking. To stimulate the imagination of audiences. To build connections and knowledge. Let me see if I can stimulate your thinking. My one half sinks all day long on the ground. My other half rests in the deep, hard bottom of the sea. Images from conservation drawing gave me a sense of security. Each half was depicted accurately. You see, I was aware both sides, the arts and the sciences, have issues with where boundaries lie. Mythological chimeras emerged somewhere between reality and dreams. Fauna from Welsh lands, waters, folklore stories. Hybrid creatures created to serve. My own fantasy. Are my nine brains enough to justify my moods and undoubtable wisdom? Are they enough for me to comprehend why you have created me like this? For me, it was a co-creation. I shared drafts with my colleagues. I explained. I paired the salmon with the mayfly, a dancing insect closely connected to the salmon's destiny, a vital food source during its river trip. My colleagues, proof selecting, ensuring accuracy of the depictions. You see, I was somewhat embarrassed, as if the hybrids might be too daring, because they were not accurate. This would always echo in my head. But then, then, they shared spontaneous ideas. They shaped the hybrids. With time, we had to choose. Only four could remain. Conceptually and aesthetically the strongest. I sense you approaching half a mile away. I hide in the deep when I don't want you to find me. You made me strong and I remained. We prevailed as prompts to inspire, to create. Through different phases, stages, you made us swimming and flying, guided by your rivers, bringing ancient wisdom to all. We are translucent. A way for you to connect to the underwater and the dream. One half, Welsh mythology. The other half, fauna. Mayflies and magnificent butterfly blennies, you appeared after a few months of creative process. You took your final form. Butterbird, Butterbird octal, octal, stagwell, stagwell and, and soulfly. My dream, an iconography. One unified, one unified iconography. iconography. We emerged, we emerged as, as the, the underwater, underwater realm. realm. Intriguing water deities, equal measures of calm and torrent, rivers of thought, style, colours, neither one nor another, an alien world. Ferruginous resonation, I think of silt, of one's pollution of waters, my past. Inward looking, I consider myths, legends, future generations with calming butterbird. Out of frame, escape our gaze, shall fly. Swim into bankside vegetation. Curious, I want to know more. Under the microscope, take them in. In, what was the inspiration? Creative collaboration in a state of limbo. In some weird natural world. Stag whale, its vulnerability challenges the onlooker, etc. Octal makes me think, etc. Carefully look, dive into the murkiness, find fantastic creatures, find chimera like qualities in nature. Low visibility, murkiness, visibility, remember to frame rivers.